All right, we got something a little different for you today. I did the hot car test, which was put these things on the dashboard in direct sun in my closed up car, windows rolled up, doors closed, etc. And uh, needless to say, the results aren't good. It's 96-ish today, uh, although says feels like a hundred and inside the car it was even hotter so I expected it to be bad and this was a test I've been putting off doing for a little while but uh, here, as you can see whew. Whew. Uh, what's funny is some of this is still reusable uh, it snapped the uh, the seal right off but it also caused these, like, this warpage. Because it's, yeah, it's bent out and bowed out a little bit. Uh, I think it's a lot of heat warpage. And it caused all these stress fractures, which, I mean, obviously. Whoop! But. I mean, I didn't think these things would do super good in the heat. I didn't think they would explode like this. You can see we got got some little heat fractures in there. Obviously got this guy, which just split in the strangest way. And you can even see, now that they're broken up, just how thick those uh, some of those parts are. So those are supposed to be fairly sturdy and uh, able to stand up to some some punishment. But uh, not the fury of of a hot day. Uh, let me see. Ugh. And likewise, like, just fairly thick, chunky pieces. Let me find, here, let me first towel off. Got my calipers over here. Like, you can see these are meant to be fairly thick pieces. So they're supposed to have some strength to them. And under normal circumstances, these things can hold up to a beating, but that heat plus that internal pressure from the... I imagine from the liquid inside literally boiling and expanding just, uh, just takes the whole thing apart. Uh, so I'm thinking if this is an issue I can solve, this might just have to be something where if I send these out, there's a, a warning for any, um, well, yeah. There's a warning for uh, anybody buying in any uh, especially hot states. Oh, there we go. Let me see how much junk we got in there. Um, this is peeling off some of the uh, some of the clear coat on there, but this is honestly still. This one might be reusable. I don't know if I should, given that it's gone through heat warpage and other issues. But my first thought is. For any future ones I do, to make those walls even thicker, because they're fairly sturdy on their own. Like, it mm, takes some effort to fully break them apart. Uh, at least that's when the prints are completely solid. There is a little bit of rigidity lost on each of the sections where the numbers are in there, just because that's that little sort of... Um, so, uh, it's it's disturbing the the smooth uh, cylindrical sort of like um, compression of tech, uh, pressure, I guess. I, uh, that's what I'm trying to say. Like the reason soda cans and soda bottles work is because they have that nice continuous uh, and consistent pressure uh, on all sides. Like, that's got a little split in it, but yeah, like. Surprised a few of these survived as well as they did, just with little minor cracks, like sort of right along this bottom area where there's a slight separation, which is, you know, it's kind of good, but all the same, if there's enough pressure in there that it's it's causing any other parts to crack, it's already doomed. So, I mean, it, it's good news and also just like, does it really matter? Um, but. Yeah, uh, I don't want to say back to the drawing board, but 
if I'm going to continue making these or trying to improve these, like, wow, you can see just how much warpage that one piece has. If this would focus, whoop, there we go. Like, that is straight up curved when it shouldn't be. Either way, mildly interesting. Ugh. I'm probably going to be doing a, a full proper video on this a little later. Uh, just on the whole design process and iteration and how I kind of got to this point. But uh, at the moment, you can see in the most extreme conditions at over 100 degrees Fahrenheit, uh, these things sadly do not survive, which... Uh, I hate to say, but it's also, it's it's a legitimate concern. And even though these aren't like dangerous sharp shrapnel kind of pieces, uh, like I wouldn't be too worried about even stepping on those. It would hurt, but it wouldn't, wouldn't stab me. It's still not good that they break at all, even under the most extreme circumstances. So I'm going to have to see if I can maybe mitigate some of that by... Uh, making them thicker and sturdier or by uh just uh, maybe i sell them as kits maybe i sell them as you know some assembly required and i give you the little the recipe for uh getting that nice goop because that's just mineral oil food coloring water and a little bit of uh, isopropyl alcohol so it's it's not out of the realm of possibility but it is unfortunate that uh that the damn it, well, that the uh, the elements win in this case, as much as I would love to say I can beat them. But we'll see if further improvements can uh, do anything about that. So, thanks for watching, and uh, I don't know, hang in there for whenever I get around to working on a proper video.